everybody, it's Mama J. Inspector. We are here with a review video. Okay. So, uh, this is a new company, Superhero Collector. I spoke with them and I'm going to review two of their mystery boxes, one today and we're going to do another one tomorrow. Okay. And then tomorrow during the review, we're going to give you a code to save 10% on a mystery box if you want to go purchase one. Right? Pretty awesome. So let me give you a little bit of details about the company here. They're called Superhero Collector. It's a new online business in Miami dedicated to providing amazing deals and a great variety of comics, collectibles, toys, and statues related to the entertainment industry. We have many deals and new products each week, being our customer's priority. If you cannot find some products in stock or pre-order, just contact us and we will check with our distributors to see the availability of it. Um, so that's pretty awesome. If you're looking for something, you can reach out to them. They may be able to help you. Yeah. So they had three different mystery boxes on their website. They were $29.99, $39.99, and $49.99. Okay. We went with the $29.99 one, and tomorrow we'll review the $49.99 one. Okay. Okay? So, um, real quick, let me give you some information about the mystery box. Okay, so this one um, is called mystery box number two. Okay. It's $29.99, and it is four pops, and it should have one sticker pop, so okay. one exclusive. Um, the other box that we did not go with was called box number three, and that was four pops with four stickered exclusives. Okay. But I wanted to go with the cheapest and the most expensive so we can compare them. So, $29.99, if you spend $60, you do get free shipping. Okay. So, because I ordered both mystery boxes, I ended up with free shipping. All right, so we're gonna cut into this box see what we got for $29.99. Okay. All right, so let's cut it open and see what we got inside here. So again, um, tomorrow we will review the second box, so make sure you guys show up. And I'll give you a code. They do sell other, other items on their um, website, not just mystery boxes, so you can purchase certain pops and things like that, and other collectibles. So, are they wrapped? Okay. They are not wrapped. Oh wait, they're kind of wrapped. Okay. Um, all right. So first, there is a little business thing here, and they also I do know that if you speak Spanish, they also carry comic books in Spanish, which is not normal on a lot of the websites. So that's their little card there. Uh, looks like three are not wrapped and one is, okay? Okay, so the so, one that's wrapped is probably our sticker. Yeah, that's what I'm going to assume is probably, so we will let that one sit to the side. And these three are wrapped like, where well, we're not really going to get a choice but to unwrap them here. <laughs> okay, so there's the first one if you want to review that. So this is Barbara from Wonder Woman. Has a some corner damage here though. Yeah, see that's um the other thing I noticed too. So here we have Agent H from Men in Black. This pop is also extremely damaged. Um, now the mystery box did have a little bit of damage to the front, um, some crunching, but um, yeah, here's um another damaged pop so I will be reaching out to them and letting them know because yeah all three of these pops are trash every one of them because well that one's not too too bad but these two are trash we don't collect pops out of the box so those for us are considered trash yeah um, now like I said we will reach out to them um, they did have it wrapped like this 
And then on one side they had this, and that was the side that got crunched, okay? But, um, these are still pretty damaged. So, I did get this, which was not the keychain I ordered, so I'm assuming maybe this is an extra keychain they threw in. Okay. And let's take a look at what we got here. And we got PlayStation. I'm not sure. Alloy? Alloy? I have no idea. Alloy? All right, so we're going to check value on these as if they weren't damaged uh, because I this could be a possible post op, um, office issue because if you look, like I said, the box did have some damage to it. So let's go ahead and check some value on these. Okay, so we checked some value, and um, if they weren't damaged, Shazam was worth five dollars. Five dollars. Men in Black. Seven. The Wonder Woman pop. Eleven. And the PlayStation pop. Twenty-two. Yeah. So let's see. Thirty-three. Forty-five dollars. Not too bad for a thirty-dollar box. Um, again, like I said, I'm gonna reach out to them. So I will let you guys know uh, how they handle this issue. I will add that in and let people know um, how they handle the issue of damaged product. Yeah. So, but I mean, value-wise, we got our value. Yes. So that's pretty awesome. So we did get our value, value-wise. Um, unfortunately, like I said, these both have major damage. This has minor damage. This one on a on another note though is is in really good shape so this one did come out in really good shape so all right so again guys check with us tomorrow where we're gonna review the second box which is a 49.99 box and see how we do in that box again like I said the box did show up damaged so we'll see how they handle that type of issue and tomorrow we'll review the next box okay all right bye bye bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be.